Hi, I'm Craig Bryant with Bryant Electric Services and I've been in business in Austin for almost 30 years now. I've been asked um, by many people a lot of different things about electrical work and um, so I hope I can help with answering some of your questions as well. Okay, I've been asked many times um, about the difference between aluminum and copper wire and um, the biggest difference is that copper is just a lot more stable metal than aluminum is. In electricity, the biggest um, enemy to electricity is heat. The hotter it gets, the more important it is to have a stable metal. Uh, al aluminum is good, but not as good in that in the long run, over many years or decades, because of the instability of aluminum, when it heats up, it contracts and expands. As it cools down, it, it contracts and heats, it expands. So that happening over time, over years and decades, especially to um, uh, at your main service or at wall plugs or something, then that causes a loose connection and it starts arcing and the arc can create a fire over time. That just doesn't occur in copper um, ever if it's installed properly and it's real tight at the beginning. So when it's when it's installed. So um, the other problem with aluminum is oxidation. As they're both exposed to air, copper oxidizes as, as you can see when it turns green, but it doesn't affect the connection of the wire. Whereas aluminum, when it oxidizes, it creates this crust that builds on it, and you've probably seen it before, but it gets, this crust can sometimes get as much as a quarter inch thick. And besides that, uh, the fact that the metal is not as compatible to the heat and temperature problem it with that crust building up it'll also create a gap between the uh, connections that can cause an arcing. So copper is always better than aluminum in everything except price and the main reason that it's being used is because it's so much cheaper.